Saudara-saudari sekalian, penduduk Pasiris Ponggol, Ponggol East dan Sengkang West. Pilihan raya ini berkenaan apa? Dalam pilihan raya ini, anda akan mengundi pasukan yang anda percayai untuk masa depan anda. Faktor utama yang telah menjadikan Singapura stabil dan kuat sepanjang 50 tahun lalu adalah kerana adanya satu pasukan yang mantap, satu pasukan satu pasukan berintegriti, satu pasukan yang mempunyai keupayaan untuk melihat ke hadapan dan yang penting juga melaksanakan rancangan untuk masa kini. Sejak merdeka, pemerintah PAP telah bekerjasama dengan rakyat Singapura termasuk masyarakat Melayu Islam kita untuk terus memperbaik kehidupan semua rakyat Singapura. Kita bangga melihat masyarakat Melayu Islam kita mencapai kemajuan yang baik sejak beberapa dekad yang lalu. Dan kita dapat lihat Orang Melayu Islam cemerlang dalam pelbagai bidang. Saintis penyelidikan, doktor, pegawai SAF dan polis, guru, juruterbang pejuang, peguam, dan penerima beasiswa PSC dan pemerintah. Sama seperti rakyat Singapura yang lain, ramai keluarga Melayu Islam telah mendapat manfaat daripada dasar-dasar baru di peringkat nasional Pakej Generasi Perintis Medisyen Life yang baru dan CPF Life yang lebih fleksibel juga akan memberi jaminan yang lebih untuk semua rakyat Singapura sepanjang hayat mereka Pemerintah akan terus gigi berusaha untuk membantu masyarakat Melayu Islam mencapai kemajuan yang lebih baik pada tahun-tahun akan datang Lebih ramai golongan muda Melayu Islam Melanjutkan pelajaran ke peringkat pasca mendengar Skills Future akan membolehkan setiap orang meningkatkan diri Dan mempunyai pekerjaan yang lebih baik Pasiris Ponggol kita Terus giat bergembar dengan penuh Bertenaga. Kami telah membuka kemudahan baru untuk penduduk kita Dan menaik taraf estet perumahan kita yang dibina awam Kami juga telah mengulurkan bantuan kepada penduduk yang memerlukan Rakan sepasokan saya dan saya sendiri Mengucapkan terima kasih banyak atas sokongan kuat anda Dan berharap untuk terus bekerjasama dengan anda pada tahun-tahun akan datang Kami berharap anda akan mengundi bagi kesinambungan dan kestabilan Singapura Untuk membawa negara kita ke hadapan ke arah SG100 Sokonglah kamu untuk membina sebuah pasukan kepimpinan Singapura yang baik Yang boleh bekerjasama dengan anda Untuk masa depan anda Untuk masa depan anak-anak anda Undilah parti yang akan bekerjasama dengan anda Untuk anda dan demi Singapura Undilah PAP Gowe 可靠的政府 
立下的榜样。过去五十年，人民行动党一直努力改善国人的生活，让大家和新加坡一起前进。我们听取国人的意见，不断改善政策。尽量符合国人的需求和愿望。为了照顾年长者，我们推出“建国一代”配套、新的终身健保双全计划和更灵活的公积金终身入息计划，也为国人提供更多保障。我们还是。需要诚实、能干的领导带领新加坡继续发展。我们的白沙反而越来越充满活力。我们为居民提供更多新设施，更新旧区，改进公共交通。我和同僚们感谢大家多年来的大力支持，也希望继续和大家合作，为大家服务，让我们一起建设更美好的白沙榜了，让我们一起迈向未来，向 SG 一百前进。把票投给你信任的政党，为你努力的政党，为你孩子努力的政党，为新加坡努力的政党。你我同心，为国为民，请票投给人民行动党。谢谢大家。Dear residents of Pasiris Bongo, my friends, especially in Bongo East and also in Sengkang West, this year we celebrate SG50. We have much to celebrate. We have built a harmonious, stable society. But this was not always the case. We started as a divided society, torn apart by race and religion, labor and politics. On 2nd September 1964, almost exactly 51 years ago to the day, racial riots broke out. 13 people were killed, more than 100 were injured. And that was not all. There were violent communist insurgencies all across Southeast Asia that affected us. Confrontasi from Indonesia with bombs going off, including along Orchard Road at McDonald House. Our economy was cut off from Indonesia, and then from Malaysia too, after separation. Singaporeans feared for the value of the Singapore dollar, and I still remember they preferred to keep the ringgit because we had no tin, we had no rubber to keep the Sing dollar strong. What a tremendous change 50 years has brought us. Today, the Sing dollar is worth three ringgit. We live together in peace, stability, and harmony, regardless of race, language, or religion. We have achieved much together, but we must never take what we have for granted. You don't have to look very far to find unhappy examples. Race and religion still frequently spark riots and killings in neighboring countries. Instead of communism, we now have violent extremism. Terrorist attacks in our region have taken lives, including Singaporean lives, in Bangkok and Mumbai. The terrorist plot unfolding in Bangkok is terrifying. And can it happen to us here? Just this past weekend, Versailles 4.0 rallies took place, not just in Malaysia, but also 
in cities all around the world. Before that, the red and yellow shirt movements in Bangkok, Occupy Central in Hong Kong, and the student occupation of Parliament House in Taiwan brought chaos and paralysis to the country. Is that the kind of democracy and freedom that we want? The democracy and freedom to bring a country into stoppage and unable to progress? We want the democracy and freedom to work together, to come together as one people, so that we can bring the country forward. There are many challenges that we have to face. The region and the world are facing growing economic uncertainty, weak demand, and financial shock after financial shock, not in the developing countries, but the most developed countries in the world. These problems, terrorist attacks, economic turmoil, confrontation rather than consensus in politics, can easily spill over to our shores and destroy the peace and stability and progress that we have enjoyed for many decades. We need a strong and stable government to keep Singapore going, to build a better life for all of us in Singapore. We will work with you, for you, and for Singapore. We have no natural resources, yet Singaporeans' lives have improved steadily over the past five decades, year after year, as Singapore progressed. And how did we succeed? We tackled challenges together. We have a government that works together with you, with you, and for all of us here in Singapore. The PAP works with you to fulfill our shared dream of making Singapore a home we are all proud of. We work hard together to strengthen and enlarge what we have in common, while others may find all the little differences that we have and pretend to make you feel better. It's like a mosquito bite. It says, look, let me scratch. Does that feel better? Let me scratch some more. Does that feel better? And in the end, what happens? You get a sore forming and you become sick and ill. It is easy to deliberately rake up and accentuate differences to cause confrontation and disharmony. But it is not so easy and much harder to have constructive dialogue and build consensus to bring people together to achieve a common goal, a greater whole that brings benefits to Singapore and Singaporeans. Just like we did directly with all our people through the One Singapore Conversations, which has resulted in consensus building and new programs and policies for Singapore. We have done it here in Singapore with the PAP government working with you and we will continue to do so. The PAP government works for you, putting your interests at the heart of all we do. And that is why my colleagues sitting up here with me that's why we are in politics. That's why we are with the PAP. That's why we put ourselves before you to seek your vote. Because we want to work for you. <laughs> Educational opportunities continue to improve for each new generation of Singaporeans. Among developed Asian cities, only here in Singapore can young couples even those with low income, own their own homes. And how do we know that? 100,000 new HDB flats were built in the last five years. 100,000 families. Many of them here in Senkang, in Pongol, in Basiris, now have their own homes. New homes. That includes singles and old folks as well in studio apartments. Where else in Asia can you find that? The Pioneer Generation Package for our seniors, MediShield Life for all Singaporeans, and a more flexible CPF life provide more assurance for all of us as we grow old. And we all will grow old one day. 
Today, we have about 400,000 Singaporeans over the age of 65. And by 2030, there will be 900,000 of us. And I say us because that includes me. <laughs> so we better make the preparations today to make sure that we can look after ourselves here in Singapore. Everyone progresses together in Singapore as Singapore develops, leaving no one behind. Which government, which country is able to do that? And to do that while keeping our, financials, our financial status stable for the long term without going bankrupt. We are honest and upfront with Singaporeans when we face difficult issues, explaining the issues, the consequences, and the trade-offs. We are open and transparent. We don't hide things from you. We tell you what the real deal is and what the problems are. We share them with each other so that we can solve the problems together. Whatever the circumstances, we always try to do our best for Singaporeans, working with you, for you, and helping to improve the lives of all Singaporeans. The PAP works with Singaporeans and for Singaporeans to set out a clear direction for Singapore for the future. We have benefited from good leadership from the pioneer generation with Mr. Lee Kuan Yew and his cabinet, with Mr. Go Chok Tong and his team working with Singaporeans, and now with PM Lee Sien Lung's team working with all of us. We have the long-term plans, the long-term vision and the ability to carry them through for Singapore and for you. Our long-term vision and our plans have enabled us to overcome problem after problem. Housing, water, keeping our port and airport among the best in the world. To create an economy through R&D so that Singaporeans can have good jobs for the future in an innovative and entrepreneurial smart nation. In all that we do, the PAP works for Singapore and Singaporeans. We succeed because we stand together. Singaporeans stood together to overcome threats and independence and to tackle issues such as SARS. When Mr. Lee Kuan Yew passed away in March, we stood united in grief. But we also stood united in a shared desire thank him for his life's work and to pledge to stay true to the ideals and the vision of our founding generation that was set out by Mr. Lee Kuan Yew. So let us stay true to that. At this year's National Day Parade, Singaporeans of all races and ages cheered with one voice at what we have achieved together for the past 50 years. And we all sang home together, proud to be Singaporeans, proud of this little red dot we call home, and set the national pledge to continue building our nation together. And here, in our own home, our little home here in Pasris Pongo, we have also come together as a community. And I would like to thank all of you for the support that you have given to me as your Member of Parliament here in Pasiris Pongo for the past 18 years, I've grown to know many of you. And I'm getting to know many of our new residents who are moving in. We have listened to your views and feedback on what you would like to see in Pasiris Pongo. We've worked with you to help make your dreams and desires come true. We have many exciting new plans to make Pasiris Pongo even better for our residents. Plans to renew and upgrade Pasiris Town, a new Senkang Hospital coming up soon to serve all of us. The new Singapore Institute of Technology, the newest university in Singapore, will be here with us in Pongo together with a creative hub. New educational opportunities, new jobs. And we have a PAP team with experience in Pasiris Pongo and also with new ideas and energy. And we are here ready to serve you if you will vote for us. Yeah. With your support in this election, I intend to have an additional MP in Pongo, that is three MPs in Pongo, to take good care of our residents in this growing and beautiful town. Dr. Janil 
has grown together with our residents in Pogo for the past five years. Daniel. Ng Chi Ming comes with a strong record of public service. And he will build on the good work of Penny Lo and serve our residents in Pogo North. And I have asked Shelling, who started helping out in Buena Vista 15 years ago, to come and serve our residents in Pogo as well. She's committed and energetic. And she's a young working mother herself and will be able to empathize and know the concerns of our many young families in Pongo. Those of you who met her will agree that she will serve our residents in Pongo well. Here in Pongo Central, comprising Compassvale and Bangkok, we will call it Senkang Central to give it a more distinctive identity. And all of you know Teo Selak, Tang Selak. He has served you here over the past 10 years. He has done good work as mayor. He's done good work with our small and medium enterprises. And he will continue to serve you here in Senkang and Bangkok. Sainal Safari will continue to look after our Pasir Ris East residents. Father Zainal has lived himself in Pasir Ris for many years and he has renewed his friendships. Zainal also works hard in NTUC to help our low-wage workers have a better life, better salaries and better opportunities. And I will continue to look after Pasir Ris West and of course all our residents in Pasir Ris Bongo. But only if you give me your support, give us your support and vote for us. We ask for your support so that we continue to do our best to serve all of you, our residents of Pasir Ris Pongo GRC well. My friends, we have achieved much as Singaporeans in the past 50 years. There is much, much more that we can achieve together in Singapore and here in Pasir Ris Pongo, Pongo East and Sankang West. How do we ensure that our next 50 years will be even better than the first 50 years? Vote for the PAP. <laughs> Continuity and stability enables us to plan ahead, to work together to achieve our shared goals, to build a better life, a better future for Singaporeans, our children and our grandchildren in Singapore and here in our little home here in Pasiris Bongo. This election is about voting for who you want to trust your future with. Trust the PAP. It's about building a strong team, not for the PAP, a strong team for Singapore to take us into the future, not five years, but 10 years, 15 years and more. We need a strong team both at home to look after ourselves, our safety, our security, our economy. But we also need good ministers to advance our interests internationally. And we need a good team of MPs to look after our town council well. <coughs> to our residents in Pogo East, let us put the troubles and the turmoil of the last three, four years behind us. And let us make a fresh start. Come together with us, with Charles Chong. Make a fresh start and let's build Pongo East and make it strong and beautiful and good once again. <laughs> let us continue to make the right choices, to vote for continuity and stability, to build on our success for our children and our future generations. There is much, much more to do. Vote for the PAP so that together we can build a strong leadership team to take Singapore steadily into the future. Ensure that Singapore continues to be a shining little red dot for many more years to come. We have here presented to all of you <coughs> our vision for Singapore. The PAP's plan to work with you, for you, and for Singapore for the future. We have before you our plans for Pasiris Pongo to work for you for the future. We have a 
team which we offer to you here in Pasir Ris Bongo, in Sengkang West and Bongo East to take you into the future. So work with us. Vote for the party that you can trust. Vote for the party that has worked with you for so many years. Vote for the PAP. Thank you very much.